What's up guys, it's me your boy Steve Random here, and in today's video I'm doing my top 5 most complimented fragrances. I'm getting a few requests for you guys that, you know, you want to see my top 5 most complimented fragrances. So here I am today bringing it to you guys. My number 5 is Dior Sauvage. Now I know you guys might be like, oh my god, again? Dior Sauvage, really? The thing is, this thing keeps getting me compliments, and there's like... I just can't say anything about it. It just keeps getting me compliments and it works and if you know if it doesn't work for you There's another four fragrances in this list that maybe would work for you um, But for me this thing that gets the job done just lasts a long time and it gets compliments and it works for any season And it's overall a very good fragrance. You can't complain about you know the negative feedback it gets or how popular it is Sometimes just gotta take the compliment. Dior Sauvage at my number five spot. My number four is Pineapple Vintage Vanilla Intense by Parfums Vintage. You might be like, Steve, you got that fragrance a month ago. How the heck has it already been in your complimented list? This thing got compliments, man. This thing I cannot, you know, stress how much it gets compliments, and I really like the smell of it. And I think it's just that vanilla added to the you know, regular Creed Aventus kind of thing that they like to do just makes it superb. I don't think I've ever used the word superb before, but this thing gets compliments and I don't know, it just surprised me so much when I used it for the first time and like the first few weeks I used it, um, you know, every other day or some days I used it, got some nice compliments. I don't know, it just, it just works. I, again, another fragrance that just works and you know, it might be hyped up, but the thing is, it does get the compliments. Pineapple Vintage uh, Vanilla Intense by Parfums Vintage at my number 4 spot. What I'm realizing in this list so far is that all these fragrances last a long time. I guess that makes sense because if it lasts longer, it's gonna get more compliments and more likely gonna be smelt by other girls, you know. If you have a long lasting fragrance, you're most likely gonna get smelt. If you have a short lasting fragrance, then you might not get smelt because it's gonna disappear after a few hours. My number three is Parfums de Marley Layton. Just the Layton, the regular version, not the exclusive. Parfums de Marley Layton is a beautiful fragrance and it gets compliments. It just works and it does well and performs well and it gets compliments and there's nothing I can do about that. It is a pretty expensive fragrance, but if you are if you have tried it before and you like it, I'm sure that it will get you compliments. Just the thing is some people find it a little bit too feminine off their skin, but some people find it great, some people find that it works for them. For me, it works on me and it gets me compliments, so that's all I could say. Definitely some of these fragrances might not work for you, but this one um, might work for you. But Layton, I find really, really attractive and I find that girls really like it when it's settled down and it's not first sprayed on. When it's settled down and it's, you know, been about four or five hours, compliments come in. Layton on my number three spot for the most compliment. My number two spot is Ultramal by John Bogatier. Ultramal is just, it gets compliments every time and I feel like it's that, you know, strong, long lasting kind of fragrance that, you know, just girls like. It smells sweet, it's peary, vanilla, it's got a little bit of everything from the sweetness kind of aspect, and it just smells so pleasant and nice and pretty strong. This thing can get compliments, and if you wanted to, it definitely can. Um, this thing lasts for a while. And all you need is like two to three sprays and you, you're set. You don't need any more, you're good for the day, and this thing gets compliments. I cannot deny how many compliments this thing has got, and it's got me one nothing that can be discussed on YouTube kind of compliment. Ultra Mile has done the job, and it is definitely one of my most complimented fragrances. If you can, give it a try, see how it does on you, and yeah. Ultra Mile at my number two spot. My number one spot is one you guys have seen before, just is very consistent and keeps getting me compliments. This thing is Invictus by Paco Rabanne. This thing is my number one, guys. I think this has been my number one for a straight year. Man, this thing, I just, I love using this one because I love smelling good and I love getting feedback on smelling good. 
just amazing to have both of these things also this thing does last for a while and you don't really need much of this and i know a lot of people say it's super synthetic but if you're not going to spray that much it won't appeal as super synthetic to other people because other people are just going to want to smell you know a nice smell they're not going to care if it's synthetic or not that's invictus by Paco Rabanne at my number one spot for my most complimented list. These were five fragrances that are most complimented, but that doesn't mean that there's not any more that gets compliments. These are ones that just work for me, others could work for you, that's pretty much it guys. Long lasting fragrances, if they smell good, equal compliments based on this list. If you guys enjoyed this video, let me know in the comments below, and peace!